Hello everybody and happy Valentine's Day. See the girls are still working very hard in the bakery, in Grace's bakery, but this is Molly and Josefina working really, really hard because they're still filling Valentine's Day orders. They have some heart-shaped cakes in here and lots of cakes in the refrigerated cabinet. So they're working really hard. And Grace over here is sporting her new outfit that I got from Zoo Lily. The boots I got from AC Moore, the, um, the Springfield collection, I believe. So we're going to go take a look at some of the new things that's going on in our doll world. I'm going to focus in on, on Grace's face as I walk through the rooms because we're spread out all over the place. And I don't want you to get dizzy. So we're heading into my daughter's room to see what's new in there. And one of our new additions to our family is Sunset. She's a little skittish yet. She's an adult cat. She's a rescue. She's like five, five or six years old. She's been in a few homes. And she has really taken a liking to my daughter, Kate. And, um, but she doesn't like the rest of us as much. So she's still, you know, it's only two weeks, but she's comfortable in here. So that's pretty much where she stays. And she hangs out with my daughter most of the time. She goes throughout the whole house, but this is where she likes it the best. Okay, back to Grace's face. And we're moving over to my completed project. And that is Samantha's ice cream parlor. I only made the freezer, and this is a there's a mirror here, and I don't want you to see me. I have a towel on my head. I colored my hair, <laughs> so um, and I also don't want you to see the mess in the back. But here it is. Here is the ice cream freezer part. I didn't do the rest of it. I just did the freezer part. And I really made it from garbage. So let's see if I can get That's it. And you see me standing there, but you're not seeing my face or my, my head in a towel. So I had shown uh, some people, uh, I had shown when it was part way done, but now it's complete. And I'm really happy with it, and it costs next to nothing. The ice cream, I used, like, those erasers. And I used souffle cups. Oh, that's better. I used souffle cups for the little cups there, and I, and I got those erasers that, um, for the ice cream. And there's an ice cream cone and a few other things. Like, there you go, and there you go. And Samantha here is sitting there having some an ice cream cake. So we must move along here, and I will show you the rest of the stuff. To dark and light, and dark and light. <laughs> okay, so we got some new finds here. And um, some of them are store-bought and some, some of them are um, thrifty finds. All right, this little cabinet I got, I think it was $2.99. It might have even been one of those times when you get certain colored stickers or half price. So I saw this. It was a pretty good price. Even if, even if I paid the $2.99, I thought it was pretty good. Cleaned it up. And not quite sure of what I'm going to do with it yet, but it's probably going to be maybe a, a cupboard in a kitchen, an old, like maybe a 50s kitchen. I don't know. I'll have to see how things develop and what other stuff I find. Now, this cart we had gotten from Hobby Lobby. 
and I can't remember how much it was, but it, it wasn't that much. And we're going to use it for the pastry cart, but then Annabelle started using it as a stroller. So that's what we're using it as. I see Caroline can push the stroller. It's just the right size, and Biddy can sit in there. So it's a little different, but hey, she's playing with it, <laughs> and that's all that's important, right? So Caroline is um, looking good in her fairly new outfit. Then I found this at Goodwill. This is probably a Biddy item. Uh, maybe Biddy twins can play with this. Little Red Rider. And that was $1.99. Couldn't pass that up. Now, see, Grace is standing next to this one of these electric stoves. Um, I think they're from the 50s. I've seen lots of other people have them as well. Uh, I found this at an estate sale. It was $15, and I don't usually pay that much for things, but I saw it and grabbed it. It's not in the greatest of shape. There's some rust on it, as you can see. So, but with the um, all the rumors of a 50s doll coming, I said... What the hey? And I spent the $15. I haven't plugged it in yet. I'm a kind of afraid because it's older than me. Um, so even though I was born in the 50s, I was born towards the end of the 50s. But it, it is really, really cool. And I haven't seen the blue ones. I've seen pink ones and white and yellow. But I said I had to get it. So I did. And then... I don't think I've shown this new bathing suit. I think we got it when um, when we were at AG store when we got Grace. I can't remember. But anyway, I really like Grace's new outfit. I had ordered a few other things from the sale, from AG sale. I haven't gotten that yet. I wanted to be able to include that in this video, but didn't get it yet. I should probably get it right after I'm done. But this is a really cute outfit and I thought it was perfect for Grace. So it has a little backpack and it has the socks and the shorts and the beret and then the boots I, I bought at, um, at AC Moore. And while I was at AC Moore I had to look at their erasers again and found found these the toothbrush and toothpaste and all that I thought that was kind of nice so I got them and then went to the supermarket today and they had these these shot glasses not that I really need a whole lot of glasses but I'm having problem walking away from things so um Maybe we can make uh, special drinks and we'll see. But we're having so much fun with all the dolls. There's always something new going on. We have our uh, mall, which I added a, a shelf to with the shoes. I got that at AC Moore too, that back shelf. And then we're able to add more shoes. And plus, we need a place to keep our shoes anyway. So I hope you all have a wonderful Valentine's Day and um, we'll see you in YouTube land. Thanks. Bye-bye.